May I remind you, you'll be dining with such an Adela and Tim Cook this evening. And uh, you'll be pleased to know that your latest toy has arrived. Oh, which one? The Aventum X, sir, from Digital Storm. Red? Why the f*** is it red? You wanted it to match the Ferrari, sir. I crashed the Ferrari last week. Are you paying attention at all? What am I even paying you for? Apologies, sir. Shall we have it repainted to match the McLaren? No, that'll take too long. Just, just buy another one. Uh, very good, sir. Wait, hold on a second. You know what? The machine's already here. I might as well take a look, even if it is ugly. Yeah, quite right, my liege. But first, rub my feet. My badminton corns are flaring up again. Bollocks! I've had quite enough of this. And you! You can't leave. I haven't even told them about our sponsor. Fix. Are you tired of getting ripped off at the mechanic when you take your car in for repairs? Fix can help you find out by giving you estimates on repairs on your actual vehicle before going in. Find out more at the link below. Many well-off people don't like flossing their wealth, whereas some go all out. They buy mansions, they throw lavish parties, they drive fancy cars just because they can. So what kind of gaming PC would someone for whom money is no object buy? Well, the type that was designed from the ground up with a, uh, if you need to ask how much, you can't afford it kind of attitude, of course, like this one, the Aventum X by Digital Storm, now in its third generation. This concept was born way back in 2010, nearly a decade ago, with the intention of signaling that Digital Storm is not just a regular system integrator, but rather one with some serious design and engineering chops, multiplied by the desire to make something an enthusiast can't just DIY for X dollars less, price be damned. Now, the hardware specs in this machine are, to be frank, nothing you can't just buy and put together yourself. Everything is off the shelf, from the ASUS Maximum 9 Hero to the G-Skill Trident Z RGB RAM to a pair of Founders Edition 2080 Ti's. Heck, e even the front-facing cooling system is all familiar parts from EK, and these fancy fans are actually Thermaltake rings. What you cannot buy, though, is the case and its accessories, like the custom machine liquid cooling distribution system back here. This was designed for the Event MX, and I love the industrial design. It makes the front-facing parts of the loop cleaner, and the soft tubing version of the Eventum gets quick disconnects running off of it for easy maintenance and upgrades. Very nice. The other custom part of the power is the distribution panel. It's up here where you can see the cables running up from the PSU and then back down to the graphics cards. And, and also the first of the Eventum X's imperfections. You see, the panel claims that it's an easy to access central point for a GPU power that eliminates the need to route additional cables for upgrades and allows a clean and tidy aesthetic. Not needing to run extra cables from deep down there in case you need to sounds like a good idea, except this panel appears to be a simple pass-through. Cable go in, cable come out. Now, I suspect anyone who actually buys one of these would not be doing any DIY upgrades, especially with the liquid cooling in place, which perhaps would explain the reason we got zero extra power cables with our machine. And do not get me started on this here cabling section. For nearly 10,000 US, I expect perfection, such as not having miscut nicks on tubing runs and not having mismatched 90 degree adapters down here that trigger my Royal Highness OCD. Now, normally I wouldn't pick on this sort of stuff, except that yes, you heard that right. This rig, as is, is nearly 10,000 US dollars. But what's even more startling is that our specimen was not perfectly stable with its out of the box 5 gigahertz all core overclock. No, uh, we, we were fortunate that we discovered the issue before running any games during our standard pre-testing checks procedure. And within a few hours, a rep was assigned to help us figure it out. And we, we got to hand it to DS Alex. He was super knowledgeable during the troubleshooting and eventually we did get it figured out. Still though, it feels like we rolled off the lot in a supercar and it, and it sputtered. 
Digital Storm says that this machine passed both IDA and Intel burn-in tests before we received it, and I actually believe them, especially because they knew who they were shipping it to. And I get that some customers want overclocking done for them, but the reality is that, like custom water cooling, if you can't plumb a loop or overclock yourself, you're probably not gonna have the time or the patience for the inevitable troubleshooting process when you find out that your, your RAM kit or your chips IMC can't handle CAS 14 on the memory timings. In the end though, we did end up with a redonkulous, red makes it go faster, towering monster with an awesome paint job. And it's fast, but just how fast? Well, to quantify that, we figured we'd drag race it against the fastest gaming PC money can buy that we built a little while back, with the two machines getting nearly identical results that are mostly in the very playable category at 4K resolution. But here's the thing. Our DIY machine, although it does cost about $4,500, that's still under half the price of the Event MX, which tells us exactly how much you're paying for its custom features. At the end of the day, luxury and value are mutually exclusive, and the Inventimex definitely gives you only one of those. So if you're looking for more than a hot-rodded Civic and want the PC status symbol equivalent of a supercar, this is the answer to your supremely first world problem. Speaking of solving problems, FreshBooks. FreshBooks is the small business accounting software custom built for how you want to work. It's the simple way to be more productive, organized, and to get paid quickly. You can create and send professional looking invoices in less than 30 seconds. You can set up online payments with just a couple of clicks and get paid up to four days faster. See when your client has seen your invoice and put an end to the guessing games. For your unrestricted 30 days free trial, just go to www.freshbooks.com slash tech tips and enter Linus Tech Tips in the How Did You Hear About Us section. So thanks for watching guys. If you like this video, then hit that like button, get subscribed, and be sure to check out the links below for where you can buy the objects that we featured in this video and check out our merch store where you can get clothes that are pretty much the opposite of what I'm wearing now. Also join our forum because that's where the cool kids hang out. See you later. You wanted it to match the Ferrari. Don't say this. I crashed you it. Can, it's gone. Completely don't even know what you're talking about. It's not a tumor. It's the Phantom X.